Hi, hi, hello friends. Welcome to my channel. I'm Jolene and I like to share all things beauty, shopping, decor, and more. Um, I love doing what I do and today I have something along the shopping beauty lines here because I picked up the Wet n Wild Marilyn Monroe um, package. Um, here she goes. She says, um, imperfection is beauty. I love that. I'm not a huge Marilyn Monroe fan. I mean, I like her, but I just thought this was a really fun set. Um, so it's got two things to it. It's, there's the front and then I've got one in the back here and we're going to get to it. So let's get started here. Okay, friends. Um, I do have, you can see I don't have a full makeup look on. Um, this carried almost everything I need for a makeup look, but there was a couple things it didn't. Now, I did already put on, this wasn't in the box, but it's the Wet n Wild um, uh, foundation. I went ahead and put it on, and it wasn't bad. The color match for me was good, and I like the, um, it just has a little, um, there you go, little dipper thing that you can just put your, put it on with and so I kind of liked it so I know this is a it's a cheaper brand so we'll see how this goes so here we go here's the first there's the first thing it's covered it has a uh, blush and highlighters it's got I don't know if this is an eyeliner this is a white liner lip liner red it's got red products it's got some powder here so I'm going to pull start pulling out these products now the back of this has like, some brushes, it has an eye, eyeshadow palette, um, eyeliner, it's got a hair thing, a lip gloss, mascara, um, I believe this is another highlighter down here. So let's, let's get going. It comes with this cute little headband, so I think I'm going to try to put it on, I don't know if I don't know about that, but it'll take my face away so I can use use some of these products. So let's, um, I did already use, it didn't have a bronzer in here, so I went ahead and used a bronzer, my favorite, the Anastasia Beverly Hills bronzer. So I had that on. I, like I said, I had this foundation on and this does not have a concealer either. And I did use... Um, a little bit of concealer. This is the Ola Hendrickson. Um, I really like this concealer. I do use it. I got it from Ipsy. So I have that one on. And then I have another favorite one I got from Ipsy. That's, um, it's from V Cosmetics. And it's just kind of a lighter pink. Kind of a little pink color. And I'm going to do a little bit more here. So I'm gonna put that on. I'm gonna then I'm gonna pull out this um I'm gonna pull out this uh powder. Okay, so here's the powder, I got the top off of it. Took me a pretty minute, but um, so inside we got the translucent powder. I don't normally use powder puffs, but because this comes with such cute little powder puffs, I think I'm gonna try it and just do a little bit on my face here. Okay, so there's the translucent powder. And I'm going to next go to, because I already have my bronzer on, um, 
I I need my mirror here to help me. Okay, so I am going to go to the blush right here. There she is. And I don't, it's just a powder. And you know how sometimes I like to put a, um, a powder on top of a, of a liquid or gel. But I'm just going to take this. I'm going to think I'm going to try the brush they have with it. They've got this brush. It's a cute brush. It's got this little crystal, um, crystal base. And so here we're going to go. Let's just try the blush here. Okay. I do notice it. It's not too profound here, but so. That's it for the blush. Then we have two highlighters here. We have a pink, pink type one and then a, a more um, air, uh, just a off-white iridescent looking. Um, this one's more of a pink tone highlighter. I don't know. I like both. Let me see here. Okay, there's that one my finger here and let's try the other one okay so they look similar the pink one here and then the clear more clear one i think i'm going to use this more clear one and i'm just going to take one of my brushes here um just going to go on here and just do a Okay, we get a good highlight. So I like that highlight look. Whoa, it's a little powerful. Okay, so there is that. And the next thing I'm going to do is, I guess I got my highlights done. It's time to go to the eyes. And I do have a brush in here. And um, we've got a little, is it a five or six palette? It's a five palette eyeshadow. It's just a neutral kind of um, colors. So I'm gonna go in with maybe the middle one and this one and use this as kind of a highlight or on my lid. Um, so let's get going to that. Now I did put I did put a base on my eyes. Um, do I not have it? Oh, here it is. It is the uh, the GC. Um, let's see, uh, Gerard Cosmetics. It's just the white, the white under eye. I did put that on. That's kind of one of my favorites right now. I've been using. So here I'm going in with the middle one, and I'm just doing. The crease in my eyes. And I'm going to take the darker color here now and I'm going to go kind of more towards the corners. Darken that up. Try to blend that in a little bit more with the other color. Quite dark. This needs some blending. Blending. Here's my blending brush. Okay, so now I'm going to come in with this color here. It's a shimmer. Um, see what that looks like. I'm just going to use my finger and I'm just going to go on my lid here with it. Not bad, I kind of like it. And let's see. Blend.
there's that. And I am going to take this, um, this is a white pencil. And I think I'm gonna do that some more in the corner here. Kind of line my eyes a little bit here with it. Inside. Okay, so that's a white eyeliner. The next thing I have in here, I, this is a brown and I'm not, it doesn't say on here if it's an eyeliner or a eyebrow pencil. I went ahead and put on my eyebrows because I didn't, wasn't sure. And I don't think it, I think it's more an eyeliner than a pencil. Um, I mean, I think it's more a eyeliner, yeah, than an eyebrow. Okay, so there's that. Let's go over here. Let's see what we got over here. Um, things I'm not using is the second highlighter. What is this? Um, this says it's a translucent powder. Anyway, there's that. I'm not going to use that. And I have a clear gloss here. Probably... I'm not going to use because I'm I've got some other um, eye products so I think I need to use this eyeliner I just broke a nail trying to get this out of here okay there we go <laughs> so and this is the um, mascara I did get another mascara to go with it I don't ever like to wear one um, just one mascara so this is the eyeliner. It's got the pencil and it's, oh, it's got two pencils. But I'm gonna go ahead and put um, it on. Okay, so there's the eyeliner and eyelashes. Okay, so I am going to first, I'm gonna use this um, MAC uh, Magic Extension um, Mascara. I love this mascara. It really lengthens your eyes. So I'm going to do this first. Length, lengthens the eyebrows or eyelashes. Okay, so now let's try the the Wet n Wild. It's called the Big Papa. Is that is that kind of a Marilyn Monroe phrase here, Big Papa? Okay, um, I like it's got kind of an hourglass wand, and let's try it. What do you think? 
Okay, so now we just have lips. And of course it's Marilyn, so we've got um, lots of red here. I've got a lip liner. I've got a lip gloss. I have a, this one looks like, okay, it's clear. Is that something you're supposed to put under your lips? Maybe, let's try it. No. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is a perfume. Okay, it smells. So it's, I think it's a perfume stick. So just put it on the wrists here. Let's see. It smells pretty, not bad. Okay, so no lips on that. That's a that's a perfume. And then I've got the lip liner right here, and it is of course red. And I've got a lipstick that is also red. Um, now I'm no Marilyn Monroe, and I don't normally wear red, but we're gonna try it here. We're gonna see if this if this works. So. Okay, now let's try the gloss. Okay, that's very, very red. Let's see here. Um, what do I need? But I think I am gonna use this translucent face powder and just kind of, okay, it's bright, it's light. Okay, there's that. So let's take the headband off. Cute headband though, right? All right, so this was a fun little set. I mean, it's, it's cheaper makeup, but it created an okay look. Tell me what you think in the comments. Um, all right, so I did use, I mean, pretty much most of the products here. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it. They have these cute powder puffs with all the, um, with all the um, highlighters and the blush. But I did use um, the blush and highlighter. I used the um, Wet n Wild. What did I do with it? Okay, I used the foundation. I used my own bronzer, but I used the Wet n Wild blush and highlighter. And I used a little bit of this. Um, this is tra this is also a translucent, but it's more of a of a um, skin tone powder. I used that. I used the um, eyeliner, black eyeliner, and I used the eyeshadow palette the five pound palette and it gave me i didn't have to i you can create a good look with just this palette the of course mascara i liked the mascara that was my second coat my first coat was my my favorite max um extension magic extension lengthening but um this this was a good this was a good mascara so um <laughs> the perfume that I thought was a lip product. There we go. And uh, is that everything I used? I think so, pretty much. Um, the lip liner, the lipstick, and the lip gloss. This, I think you can use this or this. I just happen to use this and then put this over it. Um, like I said, I'm not a real red person, but... Um, 
I did red. It's very red. So anyway, tell me what you think. I think this was a fun little uh, set. The Marilyn Monroe. Um, I don't know. It was just, it was fun. If you have a Marilyn Monroe fan, it might be a fun gift. Um, I will put a link below. I picked this up at Amazon. I was looking at some of the individual makeup um, and it just, it seemed more worth it for me to buy this set than buy some of these individually. So they did have individual products though and the, the complete box. So um, here's my after look with the Marilyn Monroe. And so, um, we saw the before look. So, what do you think? I, maybe I can put them side by side. I don't know. Anyway, um, this was fun. So, thanks for being here, for watching. If you want to go pick this up, like I said, I'll have a link below. Um, I love your support. Subscribe, hit the like button, leave me a comment, do those things that help support my channel. That would be awesome. And I will see you guys all in the next one. All right, friends. Bye-bye.